In this tutorial, we will take a look at how you can crop a single layer in Affinity Photo 2. So let's first add a couple of images we want to crop by going to File and then choosing Place. And then here you can select as many images as you want to add. When you click Open, you see that they are loaded up here at the left side and they're also loaded up to your cursor. So if you now drag, you can add this picture and then drag again to add the next one. As you can see here at the right side, we now have two layers. And the difference is if I use the crop tool, which is also available in Affinity Photo, uh, you can access it here at the left or press C as a shortcut key, but the crop tool only crops your R bars. So if I just adjust it here and then I click apply, as you can see it only adjusted the R bars, but it didn't adjust any of my layers. If you want to crop a single layer in Affinity, you will have to use a shape. So we can do that by going to the left here, and then here I'm going to choose a rectangle tool, and I'm going to make a rectangle like this. As you can see, there is a rectangle added as a new layer here, and if I want to add this peacock butterfly inside of it to crop it, then I just have to drag it on top of that layer, and now it's been added inside of the rectangle, as you can see here and it has been cropped inside of that layer. Now you can adjust the size of both simultaneously by just dragging, but you can see if you drag, you skew the image, and you can hold shift to just adjust the size of both simultaneously. You can also use a spacebar to just resize your rectangle or your shape you made. So now you're just resizing the shape, not the picture inside of it. And then you can move them around simultaneously by just selecting and moving around. If you want to adjust the size or the placement of your picture, you just open up your layer here, select the picture, and then you can move that one around inside of your rectangle. So you're not adjusting the rectangle but really the picture inside of it. And you can resize it also if you want to. And since you're using a shape to crop, that means you can use any shape available. So if you click this arrow here at the rectangle tool, you can see there are lots of shapes you can use. Um, like for example, take the heart tool and we'll make a heart, which you can move around before releasing by holding the space bar key. And then just the same thing as before, drag the image on top of the layer of the heart, and now it has been cropped inside of the heart. And then using your move tool, you can move it around, you can adjust the size simultaneously without skewing the image by holding shift, and adjust the size of only your shape by holding the spacebar and then adjust the placement or size of the picture by selecting it inside of the layer here, and then moving it around or adjusting the shape if needed, the size if needed. So that's how you can crop a single layer inside of Affinity Photo, not by using the crop tool, by, but by using shapes to crop the images inside of. Let me know in the comments below if you liked this video. Be sure to press the thumbs up button if you did. Press the subscribe button if you want to see more of my videos. I have new tutorials going live every week. And for now, thank you for watching my video. Stay creative and I hope to see you in the next one.